Hey there, this is Tiffany Jamison Vandelek here, author of the book, The Book on Pregnancy After Loss, the exact life-changing tools, techniques, and supplements I use to go from losing five babies to safely delivering three healthy babies all in less than three and a half years with confidence and ease. <laughs> That's a long-ass title, a uh, long subtitle, right? But I, you know, I think it's important to always get my point across and people to know what they're buying. <laughs> so, okay, I digress. So let me first say um, that, you know, this is a disclaimer. I'm not a doctor, I'm not a naturopath, I'm not a herbalist, I'm none of those things, okay? I don't even, I don't play a doctor on TV. I don't play a doctor with my kids. I don't, I'm just not, okay? So um, I am not even vaguely resembling a doctor. So please seek the professional advice, but, you know, advice from a medical professional regarding your particular condition. Okay, so, you're right? Okay, and my results are not typical. My results are my results. That's why I said the tools that I used, right, to go from having a bunch of babies. Okay, so just as my title suggests, I wrote um, the book on pregnancy after loss from my own experience, right? And that I did, um, or that we did, right, because it takes two um, to, to get some babies. And I can say that the tools and techniques that I used brought about some very cool kids. And I refer to these kids as the natives uh, <laughs> because they're part Dutch and they're part American. Uh, they're not part, we say and, not <laughs> so for those of you who know me on Facebook or follow me, you know that I refer to uh, those awesome babies as the natives. Okay, so a few years ago, I was bordering, no, teetering, no, okay, on the edge, like one foot on a banana peel from suicide, like seriously, um, we lost five babies, and after the loss of the twins, that was the last, the final loss before, like, everything shifted, I really, I just wanted to die, right, I just, it didn't make sense because, yeah, for those of you who have suffered loss, there's like this weird shame and like there's no words to describe the, the, the feelings that you can't even put your finger on. It's just, yeah, after losing those twins, I think that was like, okay, I, I just, I just, I want to die. Like, this is ridiculous. Like, and this was after like the secret and everything, you know, I have a vision board up. I was doing my affirmations. I was doing everything that everybody was saying that we should be doing and we still lost babies. So I was like, what the hell? I mean, literally, like, what the hell? You know, I was so angry. I hated myself. You know, I was jealous. Uh, you know, I couldn't look at babies, smell babies. So it was just, yeah. Do I even need to tell you? Right. Anybody who's had an infertility struggle um, knows what I'm speaking about. And of course, people say the stupidest shit to you ever. And yes, I said the S word. They say the stupidest stuff to you ever, right? Like, oh, just adopt. Like, are you serious? Shut up. <laughs> it's like, you know, maybe I'll make a list of all the stupid things that people say to us when we, <laughs> after. Uh, yeah. yeah, I think I will. I'll make a list because people are just dumb and they need to stop being dumb. So, and I know that in some way, um, all of those losses triggered all of that stuff for me growing up, right? Um, all of those feelings like something was wrong with me, um, how everybody else gets what they wanted, but I didn't. Everybody else had awesome parents, but I did Like, everybody had everything I always wanted. Like, you know, what's wrong with me? Why can't I have that, right? And the babies was just like the final straw. And again, this was around the time of The Secret. You know, I did all the stuff. I was thinking positive, had my vision board, and I still lost babies. And I I was in a word pissed and I realized I had to take back like charge of my baby quest right like I was listening to the doctors three of the losses I discussed this in the book were the result of me listening to the doctors right and then the final loss with the twins it was but you know the doctor meant well you know he didn't have like an ill bone in his body but he was just wrong and my instinct was saying don't do this Right, and I did it anyway, and the result was, um, you know, I lost twins. And, you know, I no longer, once I took back control of my body and the baby quest is what I call it, I no longer blindly follow doctors, right? I, I started to listen to me. I, you know, I got the information, and then I said, okay, Tiff, what's true for me? And, you know, and took action on that. Again, I'm not a medical doctor, okay? Please, you know, check these things out with your uh, medical professionals who's ever managing your care, your naturopath, whatever, okay? But this is the stuff that we used, um, and it worked. <laughs> so I thought, well, hell, you know, there might be some people out there 
who could benefit from this, who are suffering the same things that we're suffering, who, yeah, who would love some babies and love some alternatives or love to make peace with what they've gone through and to know that they're not alone because losing babies, I mean, doesn't it just feel lonely? You just feel, yeah, lonely. You feel so isolated. It's... I digress. Okay, so the book on pregnancy after loss is not like a typical mourn your loss of your babies and just be positive. Like if that's the kind of book that you're looking for, this book is not for you. I'm not going to tell you, oh, join support groups. <laughs> like, I, I don't. I didn't do that. Again, I only shared exactly what I did. Right? I didn't leave anything out. Um, and if you are looking for that type of book, the oh, just be more positive. Oh, just go ahead and adopt. Release your desire to want children. No, no. Okay, I wasn't releasing that. I didn't do that, and I have babies now. So if you're looking for that, then this book is not um, not for you. And when you purchase the book on pregnancy after loss, I want to gift you with a free copy of my audio book, which is sort of um, how I came out of that, right? The Radical Self Expert, the fast and simplest seven-step method to discover how to be your true self, change your life now, and be happy today that easy way. So that book... Um, was actually a, an Amazon bestseller like uh, last summer, right? Uh, for self-help and self-esteem. It was like number one or number two, something like that. Okay, but the point is that um, the book on pregnancy after loss it speaks specifically to our baby quest and the radical self-expert was like the vehicle to get through the baby, if that makes any sense. Like, yeah, so, cause I talk a lot about um, how I was able to deal with my head trash in the Radical Self Expert, if that makes any sense. So I thought it would be like a perfect compliment. And I want to give you something because, hell, I mean, after all you've been through, yeah, right? So you can go ahead and get um, a free copy of that book when you purchase the book on Pregnancy After Loss. So what you do is you go and purchase the book on Pregnancy After Loss, you come back to this page, you enter your name and email address, right? And your receipt number from wherever you purchased. And then I will go ahead and uh, email you back the audio file. All right, you can just download it. It's an MP3, so you can put it on um, your, yeah, your MP3 player. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, I mean, this is a little, I feel a little bit lower energy for this video because, yeah, if you watch the other, my, other of my videos, I'm more animated, but this is like more of a serious subject, so, and I'm sort of choking back my own stuff um, when I talk about this this subject, right? So my energy is a little bit uh, more subdued, if you will. But remember to share the yay. Go get the book on pregnancy after loss. Share it with your friends, your family members, uh, your support group. You know, put it everywhere so that people can have another, an alternative resource and hear my story because my hope is that my story will inspire others to sort of manage their care and, and figure all of the, and put all the pieces together and bring some awareness to the challenges of infertility and losing babies because it just freaking sucks. So go now, get the book, come back, enter your name and email address. And I'll get you the audio book for the Radical Self Expert. Cool? Okay, so this is Tiffany Jameson Vanderlock. Thank you for watching. And remember to share the yay. Share with friends, family, fam. Subscribe, um, like, uh, plus, pin. You could even pin. That'd be cool. Okay, so this is Tiffany, and I'll see you on the other side. Bye.